When Michelle Hayes looked at the apartment for rent in the building on Greenmount Avenue in Baltimore a year and a half ago, she assumed the work she saw being done was taking care of any problems. They were working on the apartment when I came to see it. So I had faith that, you know, everything would need to be completed before my move in date. Was it? No. Within weeks, Michelle said, evidence of water leaks appeared. When we moved in, within about two or three weeks, we noticed water pouring out of the bedroom closet. And not just a drip, but like a pour. There was a sheetrock panel in the top of the closet. And a maintenance person came and replaced that sheetrock panel with a wooden panel which made it harder for the water to pour through. But it didn't stop it from, from leaking. In late April, Michelle said she failed to notice water on the bathroom floor slipping and hitting her head on the wall. And in the process of hitting my head on the wall, it became lodged in the toilet paper holder that was in my bathroom. The toilet paper holder had become stuck in my throat. So in order to, in order for me to be able to speak, someone had to pull that out. Michelle went to an emergency room and had emergency surgery, she said, to relieve pressure on her spinal cord. Michelle's landlord, Jay Jalisi, a member of Maryland's House of Delegates from Baltimore County. Jalisi has a real estate business. And this is the person you dealt with to rent the apartment? Correct. Talk to about the condition of the apartment. Yes. When I came to sign, my, sign the lease, when we came to complete the process, he arrived in a vehicle with a tag on it that said House of Delegates. Michelle is now suing Jalisi, claiming he failed to correct the problems in the apartment. In addition to water leaks, she said, there's fly infestation and mold. The duty of a landlord would be to um, to fix uh, the water issue within a reasonable amount of time. Jalisi, in an email to us, accused Michelle of failing to pay rent and has filed papers in court saying she's staying in the apartment without a lease. He did not address the apartment's condition. No one says in Baltimore that uh, every apartment is going to be luxury, but the, the it, it has to be habitable. The dispute over the rent has yet to be heard in court. Jay Jalisi said he has not yet seen Michelle Hayes' lawsuit. I'm Jane Miller, WBAL-TV 11 News.